This how I look with your portfolio green. I got bars, I got cash, I got everything at last. Like my whip, I did the dash, got a European baby. Hey, green. Money alone, like who made some money today? My parents see my bank account and scream out hallelujah. What's up, people? But you do not live in it. Let me make sure I. Merch. Merch is in. Merch is in. Oh my goodness. Merch is in. Oh, can you see it? Oh, you can't see it. But it says live free on the back. We eating good this morning. We making money this morning. <sighs> green, 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 green. Irish spring green. How y'all doing today? I'm up 70, 70, 70. Let me see. Boom. I'm going to pull up. I'm pulling up my Twitter. I got my Robin Hood open. I'm going to check my public application. We're going to see how all the portfolios look today. I hope you're having a great day. Got to start the day with some good energy. You know what I mean? Some great energy. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. How's everybody doing? So make sure when you come in here, make sure you drop a like on the video. Uh, make sure you comment on the video. Share the video. All of this engagement that y'all give to me is helping me be able to be shown, beat the algorithm. You know how we get back into the mixture. So you see, we are green on the day. Green, 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 green on Robin Hood. It's a great feeling. So for those of y'all who are new, if you don't know, when you come in here, I am the session. I love you. It's a great day. We're going to go over some live trading. I'm going to show you both my portfolios. Um, we always start with good energy. Always enjoy our vegetables. We always, always start with good vibrations because that's what we attract. I'm going to show you both the portfolios. What's up? If you, if this is not your first time and you've been here since day one, drop a one in the chat. Drop a one in the chat. If you've been here longer than 60 days, Drop one. Um, it's a grand day. Another blessed day that we woke up. Do you know what I'm saying? This channel is not about money. This channel is about mindset. When you master your mindset and learn how to manifest whatever the fuck you want, we can target and focus on money. We can target and focus on the girl. We can target and focus on better health, better mornings. You feel me? Oh, I see a lot of ones in here. Morning, family. I'm down today, but it's all good. We're going to see some green by the end of the day. Facts. So, I'm going to let y'all pick as usual. If, you, if, you, if you're new here, what you need to know is I have, I have two portfolios that I show y'all, Public and Robinhood. Now, y'all can go ahead and tell me which portfolio you would like to see first. If you would like to see Robinhood, you type Hood, H-O-O-D, you know, the Hood way. If you want to see Public, type Public. That's the portfolio we'll look at first today, and then we're going to get here. He said, oh, I was here before the neck tat. Damn, that's hard. That live was fire yesterday. Yes, sir. How many of y'all were able to check out the live I did yesterday with uh, the smart guy? How many of y'all were able to see that? Oh, they want to see Robin Hood. You want to see Robin Hood first? I, I dig it. Let's get it. I had a little bit of veggies left for it, really. That live is fire. Anybody who saw the live yesterday, let me know. And I'm about to show y'all something. Watch this. I want you to sit here. Where am I? Where else am I? Where's my, uh... Hold on. I got something for y'all. I want y'all to check some shit out. Now... It's the beginning of the video. I want you to understand what we got going. Um, it's been almost seven months. Giveaways straight out the pocket. Oh, y'all like the y'all like the video yesterday. All right, so we're gonna show you the Robinhood portfolio. But before we get into that, I need to show y'all something. Been doing giveaways straight out the pocket. You get what I'm saying for almost seven months. You get what I'm saying? Um, 
And with that being said, I always give away stuff to y'all. But this time, we've stepped it up. I've teamed up with The Limited Company. The Limited Company, for those of y'all who don't know, y'all always ask me, yo, Sesh, where you get them dope-ass cases? Like this here. You see this? Y'all are going to be able to get yourself one of these, yes. And it's not just going to be one. Okay, so you see that? Look how dope this is. And I got the little, you get what I'm saying? So if I want to sock it to my pocket, <laughs> you get what I'm saying? You get that right there. So y'all, what y'all think of this case right here, right? This is one design. But look how many we get to give. Look how many we get to give. Okay? So these are all different flavors. Each one will be a different flavor. I'm going to post these in my Instagram story. I just want you to understand, you're going to be getting given something. You see this? This is an off-white Supreme case, and it glows in the dark. It has a battery attachment right here at the bottom. You plug this into your phone, and the, screen, the case starts glowing in the dark. So, you know what I mean? I'm just letting y'all know. We give a shit. Everything free. NASA. You get what I'm saying? Free. Good cases. They ain't no cheap stuff. Real good cases. So, I want y'all to understand we, we got something good coming up for y'all this Friday, just like every Friday. I want to talk about crypto today as well. I just want y'all to know that too. Um, I want to talk about crypto today. Whew. Come on, let's quit playing. And my Instagram is at the session CA. So look at this one. This was real unique. That's a mirror. That's a mirror. Okay, well, this is a CD, but it's a mirror. This is fire. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, I have some, I'll post all these on my story. I'm going to post all of these on my story. and I'm going to make a post about it this Friday. And look, last thing. They even gave y'all, I know y'all want to have the same color phone as me. Some of y'all wondering, how did I get my, my shit like this green? How did I get green phone? You know what I'm saying? Skins. So they also have skins. So a black one and a blue one. Two of you will be winning these as well. So there'll be some dope ass prizes for you. Um, just wanted to put that out there. We always feeding the fam. You know, I just want to say thank you. Especially to all of y'all who just signed up for the Discord, man. Thank you. Best 5 or $10 you've ever spent. I'm grateful. Without further ado, let's get into the hood. Y'all said y'all wanted to see the hood first, so I got it here. So what I'm doing is I, I have up also my Twitter. I follow, I have a folder where there's just accounts that are related to investing. And I, I have, you know, some good resources in here. So I want to see what they're talking about. All right, so what I'm going to do, simply show you the portfolio, show you how much I'm up on a day. And then I'm going to go down each stock and tell you, how much I'm up or down on the day. Simple. Y'all ready? If you're ready, let me get 10 emojis. I'm going to run through these. And it doesn't take long because we only have seven or eight stocks. Like my wife, I did the dash. Got a European baby and I know she got some mad. Big giveaway coming. Let me see the emojis if y'all ready for this. Ready to run through these stocks. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We need good energy this morning. Let's run them likes up. Let's go. Hell yeah, I love y'all. Let's go. Let's be turnt. Let's run them likes up too. I need y'all. We're getting back in this algorithm. The subs have been going up. Thank the Lord. The subs have been going up. Um, I feel blessed. I feel grateful. Let's keep the emojis going. Let's go. Yeah, shit, let's keep going. I give I give something away today. We keep going. One of y'all already won a free, you know what I'm saying, a free TT. Free T-shirt. All right, there we go. Now we got the emojis. Make sure you drop a like on the video. So almost 60 plus of you people in here, drop a like on the video. Here we go. Let's start it off. Galt. Y'all know about Galt. I also have an option play in Galt. Galt is down on the day. 2.35% only right now. Um, as you see, it's down on the day, but I, I, I'm i praying that this is a trend to go back up. Um, Galt had a great week. Three point, almost 4% on the week. But anyway, the short and the long of it is it's down 28 bucks today. And my option call is right here. This is the option call that I have on Galt. Y'all can see clear as day. Um, one contract down on the day, but we made 35 bucks so far on the option. That's golf. Boom. Next, my baby, my favorite, or one of my favorite dividend stocks, PSEC. Y'all know about it. P-S-E-C. If you have PSEC and you are part of the PSEC gang, please drop an emoji below. Every stock that I go through, I want y'all to tell me if you have it or if you like it. So what y'all think about PSEC? Who likes it? P-S-E-C. I'm going to check it out on Twitter and see what we got. Any PSEC lovers? Any PSEC lovers? Any PSEC lovers? What we got? PSEC gang? Okay. I do see some PSEC love in here. Y'all been rocking. Cold Red, what up? What up, Mango Mango? 
What up? All right, so make sure I pull up my talking points also to make sure I went over everything. Okay. Talking points, just to make sure I went over everything. Okay, perfect. So, PSAC, what I have here, you will see. Dividend payout coming. This is a separate payment. Again, I want you all to understand when you get a dividend stock and it has a high yield, that means you get two payments. You get the payout of how your stock is performing, and then you also get a payout of just by being a shareholder. So you see, one way to find that out is when you go to the stock, this is PSEC, you'll scroll down, right? And you'll see this thing here. You'll see the dividend yield rate. Make sure you pay attention to this and make sure you pay attention to the PE ratio. The PE ratio, shout out to Peter Lynch again for teaching this. He said that it's generally used to determine how long it will take for you to recoup your investment. So this says three. So it'll take about three and a half years for us to recoup our investment. This is what the, the law he goes off of and that he's been using. Again, the purpose of a book when you read a book is not to then go out and make the same mistakes. A person took a lifetime to make a book to teach you something that you can learn in an hour. Okay. So the dividend yield percentage for PSEC is 8%. It's almost 9%. Okay, so, so on the day I made, um, we're down, I don't even know what you call it, 60 cent, 60 cent, but the total return is back almost 300 bucks. Okay, so that's PSEC. On to the next. Yes, sir, Ski. Y'all know. Y'all know. Who got Neo? Let me know if you're part of the Neo gang. Who is a part of the Neo gang? Let me know, let me know, let me know who had Neo. I know I got a lot of Neo orders in here. I know it. Let me check it out. Who in here got Neo? Who's a Neo Ninja? Huh? Let me know if you're a Neo Ninja. What we have here is Neo is up almost 2.5% of the day. And I have 64 shares and I made $68, $70 today. Y'all can see it clear as day. We didn't do, oh shit. We didn't do anything. You hear me? We didn't do anything different. Didn't do anything unusual. Again, investing is not always going to be the most exciting shit in the world. So what I will do is bring y'all videos, um, you know, sometimes top growth stocks. But all of these things are not stocks that I'm going to get in per se. These are stocks that I'm just letting you know if you don't have position yet. Like you, my, the reason every week when you come in, you see the same stocks is because I'm building the same portfolio. It's not about how many random stocks you can get. I just want to be clear with y'all shit. It's not about how many random popping stocks you can get that people talk about because you're going to go broke. How do I know? I My portfolio is down. I'm trying to tell you. I'm, I'm telling you. I was up for nine or ten months. Or pardon me. Pardon me. It hasn't been a great year. I was I was up for over eight months. And now with the, with the remaining two months to go, I'm playing catch up because I had my position spread too thin. And then after you have your position spread too thin, and let's say you go, I don't know, 60, you break even with options. All your money's going to be tied up. I'm just putting y'all on game of, you know, what helped me. I fucked off some money because I was up. I thought I knew a lot. Oh, I'm beating the market. I'm 129% on my portfolio. And yes, those things are cool. Yes, it was a blessing being up that much. But then once shit went down, it went down. The market always recovers. There's a reason that the average is between 8 and 12%. 12 being high. So I know I said a lot, but I want you to understand. Don't need a bunch of stocks. You don't need no shit ton. Next, VTNR. VTNR is up almost 4%. Right here. Boom, boom, boom. 4%. You see it? So this right here is up $9.10. This is beautiful. $15. On the day, I love it. Waking up to my little 15, I love it. Let me know if y'all have VTNR. Um, next is my baby Arrowhead. Having a little tough day. Um, having a little tough of a day. And again, I'm going to make another beginner video as well. Uh, what are what are some beginning rules? How to be, how to start as a, you know, how to start in the investments. I think you should have no more, you know, in between maybe three and five stocks. Like I think, I think between three and five stocks is a sweet spot. You can get you two to three dividends, and then you can still have room to get, you know, two or three 
different stocks that you believe in, maybe one growth, um, some ETFs. You know what I mean? Like this, there's, there's, uh, you got to get some ETFs. And that was, uh, you know, a mistake I made by hopping out of them. But I'm blessed now that I'm going to be entering the cannabis ETF. I'm blessed now that I own Apple and Tesla and some stocks that are in some of the ETFs. All right, so that's Arrowhead. Um, down, Arrowhead is down $39 today. $39 today. Um, next is my other dividend stock that I have. Again, when you're looking at dividend stocks, I base mine on the performance of the company, how long the company's been around. Um, the five-year uh, high and low, I look at the dividend yield percentage. I also look at the P.E. ratio. This is CSWC. Company's not as old as some others, but you can also remember, check out ETFs. I would highly suggest ETFs, PEY, SPY, SPHD, um, or even if you want to go to the um, realty way, the real estate way, you can get ticker symbol O, A R R. There's, there's a bunch of good ones you could check out. But this is CSWC. Y'all know about it. Yep, Capital Southwest. And this one made us $9 on the day after that AMC. How many of y'all bought AMC? I was going to buy some more to dip. Um, every time it goes down, like I said, I'm buying a little. Every time it goes down, grab a little. Every time it goes down, grab a little. So that's up. Damn, we made 15 bucks off AMC, so that's far. And then look at my baby. The stock of the day. The pick of the day. Winner's choice. Viewer's choice, this is the stock of the day. How many of y'all are in Morrow with us? Hmm? How many of y'all are in Morrow with us? Let me know. How many Morrow people do I have? Marathon Digital is the shit. I did a whole video um, yesterday. Had a meeting with uh, the CEO of B BTCS, who was actually about to be the CEO of Morrow themselves. Um, you know, shout out to Sadia for putting us on uh, Morrow. Okay, so Mara, look, let me read off some numbers to you. Listen to me. I'm going to read this off to you. On the day, Mara is up 4.85%. On the week, Mara is up 28%. On the month, Mara is up 26.84%. On the three months, Mara is up 16% damn near. On the year, 632%. Like, this is wild. So... The 52 week high was 57 bucks. Okay, so I believe we do have some room to run there. And we can go validate our plays using tip ranks. So, all I want to do is show you this on tip ranks really quickly. I want to show you simple. We made 29 bucks today. $29 right there. Clear as day. Mara, you dig? Now, I got to open tip ranks. Now, look, tip ranks is fire. You see my, my portfolio? The reason when I go here and I can see. How much money I total have is because you can import your portfolios to tip ranks. If you want tip ranks and you want to import, um, I, I think that that might be the paid version. I got the $40 code for you in the bio. But if you want the free version, this is still an amazing app. So when we check out Mara, I want y'all to see the ticker symbols here, Mara, and it says here. What does it say? Smart score of what? My smart score of what? 10. Okay. So, um, the smart score, again, we know the details that go into that, the fundamentals, the technicals, the analysts, ratings, blogger opinions, investor sentiment, hedge fund activity, um, and we have the news. So, all of these factors go in to give something a smart score. This has a smart score of a 10. And then I just want to come over here to the price prediction. This is the price prediction that they believe it's going to within the year. And we see here, boom, 48 bucks. $48, you can see it clear as day right here. Let me know what y'all think of that. What what price do you think Mara could get to? I think it's determined upon, obviously, the company and their resources, how many machines they can output, how um, well they can get these new factories and machines to work. Um, because right now they are a bit behind. Uh, they're underperforming Riot, but they're still in the top five. Um, I think it's going to come down to how well Bitcoin performs. However well Bitcoin performs, I think that's going to also come down to how well Mara does. Mara, Riot, you know, y'all know. So, 
My, let me see. I think that was all the stocks, right? Oh, one more. This will be the one we'll be getting rid of. Charge point. Boom, went up on the day. So this is a blessing. As soon as we become profitable, sell my position. And voila. So that is my Robinhood portfolio. What I, I'm about to do is I'm going to show you my public portfolio. Um, I showed you last week on cannabis and cryptos what um, cryptos I have and what shit was looking like. Cryptos have been actually going up a bit, so that's a blessing. How many of y'all are in Mara, and what do you think, what price do you think Mara can get to? How many of y'all are in Mara, and what price do you think you can get to? Got to clean the water a little bit. Right. Let me know. And are you ready for the public portfolio? I'm going to take some recommendations from y'all. Um, after I go over the public portfolio. Let me see here. What y'all think? Oh, my computer acting. I don't have THCX. I do not have that stock. He just keeps asking the same question. I think Mara can go further than 48. That's fire. I think it, yeah, I think it could touch $50, man. Uh, especially within a year's time. Look at look at how crypto's going. Whenever it has it surges, it really surges. It really surges. Okay, let me pull up the chat. Okay, perfect. I just want to make sure I can see everything up here as well. Okay, so I'm gonna go into the public portfolio. Are y'all good? Y'all alive? Y'all ready to see the public portfolio? Drop them emojis. Where's everybody at? Y'all straight? Y'all probably looking at y'all portfolio. I see them emojis, people. Let's go, let's go. We got to be joyous. We got to be happy today. We're making money today. I'm looking at my fidelity. Yeah, I thought y'all about to see y'all probably checking y'all. Checking that Mara out. Let me switch up the home screen. And again, make sure y'all use these widgets. Don't put bullshit on your phone. You see, this is the money page, okay? So make sure you put some dope widgets on. You'll see it's looking like public is green. It's always beautiful when you wake up and you see green. It, it, it makes your psyche feel good. Boom, 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 boom. We've done it. We've made $36. So overall today, um, I think we made like, what, 90 bucks or something like that? 90 something dollars. So, you know, this is a blessing. And then we look for something that is in our position that dipped and we'll, we'll, we'll leap on it. All right. So now simple and plain, I'm going to show you, we've actually been growing here on public. If you got public, follow me at the session. Um, I'm going to put the link in the description for you. So you're not gonna have to worry about that. Give me about 30 seconds. I'll have the link in there for you. Um, but we do have a group on there. There is a group, uh, there on the public app, a hundred people. So, Right now we have 20 people in it. I didn't announce it much. I'm just letting y'all trickle in. We have 80 more spots. If you want to get in the message group, periodically throughout the week, I give free Discord links. I let you know what positions I just got. I show you directly. So if you want in there, the you can go to my website. Um, the link will be in the description. I'm updating it right now. But if you want to be in that public group, I suggest you check it out. All right? So... I'm going to go through my stocks. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have eight stocks, just as usual. All right. Y'all bear with me. My computer taking a little second. Let me refresh the page real quick, y'all. All right. So let's go through it. First stock here, AVXL. Y'all know about it by now. Y'all know about my portfolio. Y'all know what I got by now. AVXL. So Dia, throw that up there for me, please. And again, I told y'all about this one a while ago. This was back when, um, damn, it might have been in spring. Um, in spring, how long have I had this position? I've had this position for 186 days. Um, so however long that is, um, we're starting, that's about five months, you know. Five or six months I had it. So we're up on the day and we're up all time. This is one of those stocks I took profit on. Again, when you get between 30, 40%, you want to take profits. I'm not your financial advisor. You do what you want. I'm just letting you know. I took some profits from this, and then I put them in different positions. 
I put them in other positions that I had. So always remember what's going on. Take some profits. Don't just be a sitting duck. Don't just leave the money in there forever. Once it goes up, whatever your average cost is, you know, you take, you have 40% profit, sell a couple shares. I don't know how many you have, but sell a couple. And then you can take that positioning instead of coming out of pocket and put it in something you see a dip on. I'm not your financial advisor. Do what you want. All right. So that's AVXL. Next is Tilray. Again, Tilray. I will... Will I, will I be keeping Tilray? Somebody let me know in the comments. Somebody let me know in the chat. Do you think I'll be keeping Tilray? Let me know. Somebody let me know. Oh my. <laughs> she said, hell no, Tilray's a goner. That's a fact. Because now we put our money where our mouth is. He said, hell no. So y'all been paying attention. I see y'all been paying attention. The Discord has been lit too. It's been such a long time since we've had a bad egg in the Discord. All the same energy y'all got there is the same energy we'd be having in the court. So what I do is get an ETF exactly. And y'all will see when I do get the ETF, when I do decide to get the ETF, I will let y'all know exactly which one I get, obviously. Um, and I want to go all in with the ETFs. I do believe that that is the best. Like, if I would have known that sooner, yes, I still would have had my Neo and shit. But, you know, maybe I would have gotten PSEC, but not CSWC and put that in an ETF instead. You know, um, not that, not that, what's the name is bad? CSWC is fire. You feel me? But I would rather have, you know what I mean? I would rather have a stock that's more trusted. And it's, ETF is a combination of securities, so it's a shit ton of stocks of the best performing stocks. They're all different ones. Russell 2000, I think they have Russell 3000. Um, like I said, PUI, SPHD, Vanguard, whatever, S&P, that. There's so many. So find the sector you want. Find the, you know, it's updated. The link is in the description. If you want to join the Discord, the links are all in the description. Everybody refresh your page like some of you are doing now. And you'll be able to see it. Okay? So Tilray is getting sold. I'll give you all the game here first. It's going to take a minute for them to become profitable. They're out of, um, I think, Canada or Australia or some shit. It's going to take them a minute to get, you know, for federal weed to be legal. Um, a year or two. Okay? Give them some time. But Tilray, boom. I'm down uh, 14 bucks. Next, Amazon. Amazon, oh my goodness. How close are we? Damn it, we're so close. Now we're at 0.95. Every day, people, we're getting closer and closer and closer. Um, if you want to, we're almost at a full share of Amazon. If you want to help me get a share of Amazon, all you have to do is sign up for public. If you Every time y'all sign up for public, you get a free stock, I get a free stock. I'm going to use my shit to get Amazon. So if y'all don't have public, make sure you go check it out so we can get this damn share of Amazon. Amazon, listen to the total price. Amazon is $3,336.06. When a stock is that big, whether it goes up or down, like for example, all right, it's down today, 0 0.2. 0 0.2 for them is almost $8. That's $7.50. So if if you, like I said, let me get, let me get you a green one. Okay, but damn, that's perfect. Couldn't have worked better. So point, down 0.2 point is down 7, 6, you know, uh, 7.46. Then that means when it goes up 0.2, you're going to make almost $8. When it goes up 1% or 2%, when it went up 1%, look at this, 1%, oh, I don't know if y'all can see it, 1% is almost $60. So I love Amazon. We know about the future of Amazon. We know that they don't test their employees for weed anymore when they hire for Amazon. We know that they have a deal coming up with football. I think it's Thursday night football with the NFL. Come on, bro, stop. Quit playing with me, bro. Amazon is Amazon. Um, I'm down $14 on it. Next, Tesla. Tesla's beautiful. We're at $714 for Tesla. Um, I have... Th oh, thank you for saying that. Hey, you say you're going to sign up so I can get that share. That's fire. Um, I have almost three, almost three and a half shares of Tesla. We got to keep going until we get to four. Um, so my average cost is 2000 No, that's a lie. My average cost is 671 bucks. So I think that entry points for Tesla are going to be in the lower 600s. If you can get it 650, you may want to eat eat a couple. 
But then as it goes down and down, that's when you want to really load up. Um, I do believe we will see, you know, if, if there's a chip shortage. Um, that's what happened with Neo. A lot of these companies are amazing, but other hindrances come up. You feel me? These are Tesla's not a car company. They're a technology company. It's a data company. So if they have all the fucking pieces in the world, but if they run out of chips, the stock will be impacted. They just gotta wait till they get some chips. Same shit happened with Neo, and it's gonna be down for a bit. Okay? I'm just putting that game on y'all. We up 140 bucks to Tesla. Next is Disney. Uh, with Disney, we still going. We almost got four shares. Uh, Disney is this. Y'all know about Disney. Hey, shout out to Laquan, man. Shout out to Laquan being a big stepper signing up. Y'all see it right there. Laquan Chang, thank you for signing up. Disney, boom, right there. Um, and that is down $1.48 on the day. And I'm down 34 bucks total in my in my positioning there. And next, who knows? The person who can guess this next stock I'm about to show you, I'll give you, I'll give you 15 seconds to guess. If you guess the next stock I'm about to show you, it's my favorite new medical stock. You guess it, I'll give you free Discord link. Let's see if anybody gets it. I'll give you, you got 14 more seconds, 13 more seconds. Let's see if you can guess it. My favorite medical stock. Nah, <laughs> I knew he's going to get it. All right, so Dre, this is it, Teladoc. Dre, pick somebody you want to give the Discord link to. Because I think you're already in there. Ain't you already in it? you already in the Discord, ain't it? Teladoc, my favorite new medical stock, bro. It's the future. Watch when y'all see me in five years. Oh, Sesh told you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah, yo, so Dre's already in. What he's going to do, he's going to pick someone from the description or from the chat. So drop them emojis. Let the emojis go crazy and let him pick someone to enter the Discord for free. Every person that's been coming in there, man, y'all been dope. And we added new channels. We got a credit channel now. We got a cards and collectibles channel. Um... I have a channel on what did I manifest. There's all sorts of shit. And we have an MVP of the week. Every week I pick three people from the Discord who've been engaging and talking nice. And then I pick one person, I buy them lunch. Every week we turned up or get a prize. You can pick yourself. If you want a card, you know, basketball card, a lot of cards, whatever you want. All different kinds of prizes. Who you picking, bro? Who was you picking? You got five seconds to pick somebody, Dre. And then the winner, you get 30 seconds to post your Instagram or we'll give the gift to someone else. So if you're just joining, um, hop right in. All you're guessing right now, actually, you're not guessing shit. You're just dropping an emoji. So drop a like on the video, drop an emoji so Dre can pick a winner. The first emoji you see. All right, here we go. The first emoji I see goes to MJ. MJ. That's the first emoji I seen was MJ on my screen. MJ, welcome to the Discord. Now, you got 29 seconds to drop your Instagram handle. Go. So I can type it down. He said, I'm on a desktop. I can't drop. Yes, you can. It's, I'm on a desktop too. The emoji is right here. Look at my screen. Emoji right there. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one, and, and bro, you don't lost. You took too long. You took too long. All right, MJ, you lucky. I'm nice. Here we go. All right, so let's go. Let me type your Instagram down. So shout out to MJ for winning. Um, make sure I type it down. It is at MJ Bean. Beanagy, you dig what I'm saying? My name's Beanagy, MJ Beanagy underscore 39. Perfect. So if y'all want to go check my dog out, this Instagram is MJ Bean Aggie underscore 39. Okay, that's that. Now I'm going to tell y'all Teladoc. And then I'm going to open the floor up to um, y'all tell me what stocks you want to see. And again, look at the merch. It is fire. The session, we live free here. Y'all, all of this shit is just coming out. It's the first time I'm announcing it. So I just want y'all to see what we got going on. You get what I'm saying? Brand new merch. All right, Teladoc. Here we go. Almost four shares. Teladoc is the future. You don't know what Teladoc is. You need to go watch my previous videos. It is the future. This is how you people used to get our med cards. A doctor appears right here on the phone. You will be able to get prescriptions. Um, 
doctor's visits, checkups, things that don't require necessarily immediate attention. You'll be able to get them from your phone or your smart device. You hear what I'm saying to you? Are you listening to me? This is the future. I've already done it. I've already seen this be done. Shout out to Ricky Rose for having a jet doc. I got that on my phone. So if they ever come to your state, you don't have to pay them big ass premiums for health insurance. Imagine paying for health insurance and you don't get sick. We're young. We don't really get sick too often, but obviously you want to be covered at some point. That's why people don't go to the doctor. That's why people don't go to the hospital and shit. You feel me? Because they don't, may not have insurance. You know what costs money just for the ambulance to pull up and take you somewhere. All right? Just letting you know. Tell the doc it is what it is. Next, this is my favorite dividend stock, Apple. Less. Apple's a dividend stock, and they pay their shareholders. You dig me? So, Apple, again, is $2.4 trillion company. $2.4 trillion company. Um, I have almost four shares um, we're sitting here at up 34 bucks on a day. So I love it. Thank you, Apple. Not $34 on a day, but total year to date. Um, and last but certainly not least is Costco. We don't quite have one share. Um, with this one, I want to build as much as I can. Right now, it looks really limp. It looks whatever because it's not a full share. But that's because I'm not going to buy it until it goes down. Like, I'm going to wait. Like, there's, there's another thing I want y'all to remember. There's Every day doesn't have to be the most exciting in the sense of you doing all these different transactions and day trade and moving this here. Some days you need to sit the hell down and just don't do shit. You don't, you wait for an entry. You have to wait for an entry. I gave y'all the entry on Apple in the 120s, 124, 126. I, I, I'm telling you, you can do what you want. And I'm not no motherfucking professional. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm working on mastering this craft. I'm going to keep getting better, keep learning and educating myself. But you're here for a reason. If you're watching the video, you want some sort of, input opinion or advice you feel me so i'm just giving you just that i think you need to calm down with all the stocks you you looking at you can look at shit put shit in your list your watch list but at, you want to deepen your position in the main things so when that way you can wake up and be paid because all of this other all these other things you don't know about you just getting in them to get in them when 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 that shit goes back to the price it's really supposed to be at you're going to be looking around like who do i blame for yeah and you don't want to sell the position when you when you took in a loss. So stay chill. Some days you don't have to do anything. Some day, most like literally last week, I think I'm three days I didn't do anything. Wait for your position. Wait, wait for your. Thank you, Sadia. Those are the stocks I have in my public portfolio, and they're all safe. You'll notice my, you, and that's why you'll notice more often my public portfolio is up green more often than my Robinhood portfolio. Do you ever notice that? It, that's only as of the last three months, but that's because the stocks I had, they were much more volatile. So yeah, they ran their course, but I didn't know how long they were going to run for. I didn't know that there was going to be an EV crash. I didn't know that um, we were going to have, the Fed was going to speak out for inflation the way they did. I didn't know that we were going to change capital gain. You know, there's a lot of variables you can't control. You feel me? So I'm saying all this shit to say, make sure you understand. Look at the stocks you're getting in. If you just starting out, you're a beginning investor. What I would do, if I was just starting, I'm coming in the bat. I'm getting Neo. I don't care what we're talking about. I'm getting some Neo and I'm getting some Apple. Those are the two things for sure I know I'm getting. Two things for sure I know I'm getting. Other than that, um, those are my two stocks. So let's say you want to go, even if you want to go to four or five stocks, um, I would get one to two other dividend stocks that I really enjoy. And they probably would be ETFs. Yes, I love PSEC. PSEC is fire. I would probably get it. But the, every other stock would be an ETF. Just because, one, I want to keep up with the market, and two, I'm having the, the world's best, America's best companies, they break them down by sector, they break them down by performance. Again, there's so many different ones. You can hop in them and you can get pieces of every one of them. So when you, like, if I just get Apple, if Apple goes down, I go down. But if I get ETF, it's, if it's 50 different stocks, if 40 of them do good, but 10 go down, I still go up. You see the difference? ETFs are a bit more safe, a bit more practical, you know, a bit more fundamental, a bit more traditional. You feel what I'm saying? So that's the route I would go. Just don't fall victim of, you get what I'm saying, L running into all these stocks because you heard it on Instagram or Twitter or some shit. They're talking about it at work. I have seen people make a lot of money, just like I'm going to post on Instagram today. People making tons of money in my Discord from AMDs and NVIDIA. Um, Neos, Square, stocks we're introducing to you in plain English. These are safe stocks. These are not stocks that we've never heard of. Yo, man, it's just penny stocks. 
The only I'm taking a risk already with that with golf. So I don't need any more flyers. You get what I'm saying? So I want to open the floor up to the family. What stock y'all want me to look up? Look at look. This is this is the face we make when we when we sick of seeing Karens. All right, so I'm gonna go. Let me know, y'all comment. Run them up. What stock do you want me to look up? I'll look it up on Tip Ranks. I'll look it up on Twitter, and I'll look at the numbers. I'll pick three of them. Y'all go. Just want to show y'all the back. The back, it will say live free. Live free. And again, this is to bring a message to racism. You get what I'm saying? And then they did what, Karen? You know what I'm saying? Okay? So I just want y'all to know that I got a bit teased now. So every time you see me, you'll probably see me in a different one. <laughs> every time you see me, I'm going to have a different flavor. And I'm going to create limited time flavors too. Limited flavors, limited time flavors. You hear me? I hear my voice crack. You hear me? Blue. I got some shit coming. I just keep making shit, bro. That's what creatives do. All right. So let's pick one of these people. Let's see. Okay, so. Damn, y'all picked a lot of good ones. And you also want to be, Elijah James, you want to be careful with the stocks that say they have a, a dividend yield percentage is super high because sometimes those are just newer stocks or sometimes those are stocks that don't perform as well but want you to invest in them um, to incentivize you to buy shares in them. I'm not saying it's going to be trash. I'm saying it. All right, so y'all want to see ChargePoint. Say less, I got ChargePoint. I've been... Uh, having charge point for phew, since I've been investing, to be honest with you. All right, so let's go ahead here to CHPT. That's what we're looking up right now. This is charge point. So for those of y'all who don't know charge point, um, we're manifesting a Tesla, brand new Tesla skirt skirt. Um, they make the, the charging stations um, for electric vehicles. I don't know that they offer their services to everyone. I'm not sure if all the chargers are the same. That's information we have to look up on our own. But what I just told you, Tesla, they make the, when you go to Walmart, Target, whatever the gas station, there's a high chance that they make the charger there. And then they will be doing battery replacements at charge point. So um, the future for them looks bright. Um, but I, my, only, my only concern is as competitors open, you know, Ford, all the companies are making EV. Remember when uh, 4G came out on our cell phones? 4G was elite. Whoa. You know, I was one of the first niggas that had 4G, and I was like, this shit is fast. You get me? But then when everyone got 4G, it wasn't that significant. You feel me? It wasn't as popping anymore. But uh, this is, th this is they're going to have some competition. Ford, Benz, everyone makes EV vehicles now. This Within the next five years... Every main manufacturer will have some sort of EV vehicle work, worked out, one model at least. Whether it be a sedan or SUV, that's irrelevant to me. Uh, but right here, I have charge point. You'll see on the day, it's going crazy. Almost 8%, 9% on the week. It's a great stock. It's a good stock. The only reason I was selling my position in this is because I want more capital to be able to put in other shit. I want to have seven stocks. I don't want to have eight. And I only have five shares. So, I want to pull this up on tip ranks, you dig? On tip ranks, it says here, this has a smart score of a four. Again, tip ranks is not the end-all be-all. It's not the end-all be-all, so we don't, have to, we don't have to do everything that they say. But it is a great guideline and group of guidelines from real investors you can see the hedge fund person's name you can see the investor's name you can check out their actual portfolio you can check out their actual performance okay so that's why i like checking this app again it's not the end all be all let's see what the price prediction is for this so they say here that's going to go up to almost 36 bucks that's good tremendous upside well, i'm telling you i'm not your financial advisor 
I'm not your financial advisor. What I'm telling you to do is you on your own checkout um, charge point. I would wait till it gets into the lower 20s and I would load. I would load. I, me, I would load. If you think it's going to go to this price, again, you could also possibly, I'm not sure if this is a part of any ETFs, but you can look up to see if this, maybe they might have one that has Lee Auto, ChargePoint, SB, um, Xpeng, everything one. I'm not sure, but ChargePoint's a dope stock. I'd say it's fire. What do y'all think in the, in the comments below? Let me know what you think. I'm going with this one being fire. I like ChargePoint. If there's not many stocks I like better than Mara or Neo. There's not many. Like Apple. There's not many stocks I like better. Like my top five is my top five. Like there's not many stocks that I like better than it. So Sadia has some suggestions. She wants me to look up something. Let me see. Sadia wants me to look up. Um I got a few puts since it ran so much in charge for okay, yeah, that's fire. Get a couple couple puts for the longer. You know, place them out, place the date out a little bit so that way you can catch it. You got to put up some capital, but when you, if you want to do a put because you, you see the run on it, then that's smart. Now you can do, but place the date out further. Place the date out further, get an end of money put, then you're able to catch that when it, when it starts to dip, whatever, boom, boom, and then sell. As soon as it dips as much as it's going to dip, you know, obviously when it starts to go up, you might want to exit up out of that bitch, but... That's a good way to make money. If you have the extra capital to do some options, you could do a little put on this. We know that it's running up sky high. It's been on fire the last week and a half. So everything that goes up eventually will come down. Good buddy just told you right here. He just told you. It's a great idea. All right, Sadia, what you want me to look up? Talk to me. Oh, S-A-V-A? -A? Cool. I got it. Sava. Little Sava. Let's see what we got. Y'all want me to look up a hey, shout out to Riker Faircloth for signing up for the Discord. Appreciate you, Brody. A hey, shout out to Cloud Huey. What up, Cloud? What up? What up? Okay, so we got Sava, S A V A. Let me pull up on Robinhood and Tip Ranks, actually. Again, the three best apps you can have for investing, in my opinion, public. Robinhood. Then you're going to go with tip ranks in no particular order. Um, Yahoo Finance is absolute fire too, Seeking Alpha Auto. But you got to pay for Seeking Alpha. All right, here we go. Sava. Sava is up 6.53% on the day. So, again, this is the ticker symbol. S-A. Can y'all see it? S-A-V-A. -A. Like Cassava. So, Cassava Sciences, we know, how, we know how science performs in this country. Science medicine, healthcare, any type of thing they can use to manipulate you, your mind or whatever, it's going to be, they're going to run it up. All right. On the week, it is up 18%. On the month is down a little 4.8. And on the last three months, it is up $60, which is 147%. Okay. So I don't even know much about this stock. Let me read about it. So this right here is the development of novel drugs and diagnostics. Uh, focuses on development product candidates intended for the treatment of Alzheimer's disease. Ooh, okay. So this one goes directly to Alzheimer's. Now, Alzheimer's is a serious disease. Don't believe it's curable. But the thing I do know is um, when I was a chef, I had to do uh, become a dietitian and help people with their health. So I know that at least if you do get Alzheimer's, I understand that less than, I think, 3% of it is genetic. So it's not hereditary in the sense of your parents didn't pass it to you. You just have a gene that could trigger that. But by you changing your diet, changing what you eat and what you do, that shit will change. Next, Alzheimer's, okay? So that's good to know. With that being said, let's see. I want to see how much an option for the stock is, just out of curiosity. Okay, so you're going to have to have some money to play around with this. To play around with Sava, you have to have some capital. Now, this is this play is for my people who actually have, you know, an increased amount of capital, 500,000. You got to have a couple racks to mess around with this. If you want to get options in Sava, um, you're going to be looking at minimum 1,000 bucks, 1,100. That's what you're looking at. Um, whether that's expensive or not, that's up to your discretion. But um, I do want to understand what, did they have a breakthrough recently? Is there some news that supports this? Like what's going on with them? Damn, smart score is a 10. 
So for my people who have some capital, I'm sh we showing you plays right here. It's between me and the Discord and the beautiful YouTube, we giving y'all plays. You can check some out. Again, this is for my people who need growth stocks. Not for people who already have and want to just keep for some reason wasting money. If you do not have position and you have more capital, okay? So the price prediction for this is $140. They project they project this to go from $102 to $140. Bucks. That's beautiful. I like this. Rick, Sadia, whoever else shouted this out. I like what I'm seeing so far. Um, now, they do have a good no, good number of analysts that have voted on this. There's five analysts that say, four say this is a buy, one say it's a hold. So to me, a hold is a buy or a buy low and hold for a duration of time. Um, okay, we got some good investors that are talking about this. These are all the top ranked investors on the platform and they say that this is a buy. I want to see what's going on in the news. Um, it hasn't been talked about as heavy. Uh, the media buzz is not that heavy this week. Well, it's Monday or last week. Um, it does have a positive news score, but it's it's just barely average. Um, but I do want to look up an article. Let me see some articles. Three things about cassava sciences that investors should know. Here we go. I got some articles coming on Sava. I really don't do read the articles live when I'm live like this, but I, I'm interested in this and I want to see. Okay, so apparently they've been granted access to do some research. That's the first thing. They're developing, they're developing a drug to cure Alzheimer's disease um, or not to cure, to treat. Interesting. They don't want to cure much here in America. Okay, anywho. Just because competitors have stumbled doesn't mean cassava will too. Even if the company does experience a setback in the future, it could still have a high chance of success. The Motley Fool is writing this article, and they're telling you in live English. Even if the company does experience a setback in the future, it could still have a, it will still have a chance of high success. The exact same thing happened with Arrowhead. Did who was in Arrowhead with me? I had Arrowhead at ninety dollars. I got it at fifty six dollars, went all the way to ninety. I ate. Okay, this is what I'm telling you. The the importance of being patient. The importance of selling your profits. I'm telling you, this right here. They're telling you that their uh, Arrowhead was granted some permission to do something just like this and then develop a drug. But when that drug pauses or they have to stop it for any point, they do these drug tests on animals and mice and shit. So I want you to keep that in mind. This is a long this. This is looking like a long, a long term. Um, they've completed phase two. This sounds very familiar to Galt and it sounds very familiar to Arrowhead. But when something pauses, just understand that that stock will dip and it can dip drastically. But that is the time we'll buy, 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 because we know what the future holds for this. Um, the stock is starting to appeal to, to, to a different group of investors. Um, they're saying that the, co the competitors' failures don't mean anything to them um, because they use a different type of commercializing Alzheimer's therapy. I like it. Not without. I have to read much more into it, but I, it looks like it's a dope stock. It looks like... Um, I would probably wait to get into it, you know, because being is that right now, over the last three months, it's up 150%. Over the last week, it's up 19%. And on the day, it's up another seven. I would chill out. I would chill out and let this bit touch $80. Let this bit touch. You know, um, if y'all have the other chart, uh, one way to calculate an entry point is shout out to Ian McClaw. I definitely want to work with you, Brody. Shout out to all y'all boys that earn your leisure. If you have the other charts, um, I think it's Think or Swim or Charles Schwab or Fidelity, where you can actually draw your chart lines, you can take the chart out, again, shout out to Ian McClaw, to the, the five-year high and low, and then I think the, uh, the point you're looking for is in between 26 and 27%. In between there, you will find a point that is going to be your entry point. At least that's, that's what I would use to find the entry point to Cassava, so... I'm looking at about 80 bucks to get into this, man. Uh, the five-year high. Well, the five-year low for this stock is 1386. Yeah, 1386, and the high is a buck 46. So some of you may not want to wait that long, right? Let's say, let's say for example, it was $54, right? Let's say that number came up to $54, and it's going to take a while for it to get to 54. So what you could do is when it touches 78, when it touches 80, I'm grabbing, I'm grabbing, I'm grabbing. That's called dollar cost averaging. 
That's why it's not the easiest thing in the world to just come into a stock market and just, I'm buying it. You got to wait for your entry. You hear me? Sava's a good long hold. I like it. If you got an option, if you got the capital for an option, go ahead, man. If you got one, two, three racks, because I'm going to tell you, I'm going to do a hypothetical one with y'all. I'm going to tell you straight up. I'm going to take it to September 3rd. I'm going to make a hypothetical one. If I believed in this stock so much, right? Let's say I got a, a $100 call, okay? I'm going to show you all something. If I got a $100 call and I got a contract, it will cost me this much money, about $1,700. And then once I got to $116.90, let's see how much I will make. If this were to go to $123, right if this stock were to go to 123 i would make 610 dollars oh shit y'all can't see that but i would make you know and that's just when it gets to 123 and then everything after that is is beautiful so if you think the stock's going to go back up to its 52 week high if you think the stock's going to keep surging if you see some news that you think oh i know about alzheimer's research i'm gonna get in it go ahead i'm uh, i'm believing in this is how i'm bettering my portfolio man i'm Keeping a position I already got, and I'm building the shit I already have. I'm building the stocks that I already have. The reason I'll ever show you new growth stocks and new this and that, that's because I want to show people who don't have any. All right, so I showed you some stocks. I love you. Hope you've enjoyed everything. Who's ready for these? Who's ready for the giveaway this Friday? Who is ready for the giveaway this Friday? You getting case after case after case. I got some skins for y'all. This is a dope giveaway that's coming from The Limited Co. May y'all make sure I go check out my Instagram later on today. I'm going to post a bunch of different cases online. I got a cool little ad I made. If you want some of the merch, man, and new tees. Um, someone has won one already last week. Um, I gave, gave one away. But also, if you if you want to purchase one to support anyway, Discord is right there in the link below. Um, if you want one of these shirts, I suggest you go to my Instagram. Or you can go to the link right there in the description. The merch is here. You see it. I think it should be under my video, correct? Yeah, you can see the merch right there on, on the underneath the video. These will be posted on my Instagram at the session CA by noon today. I gotta go meditate. We made some money. You know what I mean? Got me a shirt. Hey, Sadia, thank you for buying the shirt. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. If y'all like these shirts, let me get the emojis. If y'all like these shirts and y'all sick of seeing racist shit go on, if you sick of seeing um, racist remarks, or you sick of hearing. Because I know I have a lot of good white homies. I got a lot of good Asian homies. I got a lot of good Mexican homies. I got a lot of different race people. And they sick and tired of seeing this shit too. This is the funniest way to get it. And then they did what, Karen? You know what I'm saying? We're living free here. We got live free on the back. If y'all sick of seeing that shit, let me see the emojis. You know what I mean? Because this is a way we can tackle it. Because if you come on, no matter what race you are, if you come in with this shirt, your parents going to be like, what's a Karen? It creates a conversation. Oh, you don't, or when people see your shirt, it's a talking point. Oh, that's a fire shirt. When people see your shirt, they're going to be like, yeah, I don't fuck with them bitches either. I don't fuck with that racism either. Okay? So make sure y'all go support. I love y'all, man. Thank y'all for always showing love. Um, we are on the road to, well, 100K subscribers, 100K in investments. Uh, but the short-term goals are 20K in investments and 70,000 subscribers. We are at 69.5. Very grateful, man. Let's break this algorithm back open. Get back into the mix. I love you, man. That's all I got. Share this video. Like this video. Every video we get, every video we get that gets 400 likes, I will be giving 10 free Discord links away. You dig?